From the deepest ocean trenches to the heart of rainforests, our planet teems with life in its most curious forms. Today, we journey into the strange and fascinating world of worms, creatures often overlooked yet possessing a beauty and complexity that will astound you. This is no ordinary exploration, for we're about to encounter 10 weirdest worms in the world. Prepare to be amazed as we delve into the hidden lives of these extraordinary invertebrates. How are you guys? It's Aaron Polo TV here. Don't forget to subscribe and follow my channel so you'll always be updated with my new videos like this. So let's get started. Our journey begins with a creature as striking as its namesake. Meet the tiger flatworm, a master of camouflage draped in the colors of the jungle. Its vibrant stripes are no mere decoration. They serve as a warning to potential predators, a signal of the toxins hidden within its skin. Unlike the roundworms we often encounter, the tiger flatworm possesses a unique flat body structure, perfectly adapted for gliding through its humid undergrowth habitat. This flattened form allows it to navigate tight spaces, slithering beneath leaves and through the soil with ease. The tiger flatworm is a hermaphrodite, meaning it possesses both male and female reproductive organs. This remarkable adaptation ensures its survival, allowing it to reproduce even in isolation. When threatened, the tiger flatworm can detach a part of its body, leaving it behind to distract predators while it makes its escape. Each fragment then has the remarkable ability to regenerate into a fully formed individual, a testament to the resilience of life in its most extraordinary forms. From the vibrant rainforest, we journey to the murky depths of freshwater ponds and streams, home to a creature with a much more sinister reputation. The horsehair worm, a parasitic nightmare that takes control of its host's very mind. These thin, hair-like worms, often reaching lengths of several inches, begin their lives as larvae, inhabiting the bodies of unsuspecting insects, such as crickets and grasshoppers. As the larva grows, it feeds on the host's internal organs, slowly but surely gaining control of its unfortunate victim. The horsehair worm manipulates the insect's behavior, compelling it to seek out water and ultimately drown itself. Once submerged, the adult horsehair worm emerges from the drowned insect's body, ready to mate and continue its reign of terror. Though unsettling, the horsehair worm plays a crucial role in its ecosystem, regulating insect populations and ensuring the delicate balance of life in freshwater environments. Our journey takes us now to the most extreme environments on Earth, the frozen wastelands of glaciers and ice sheets. Here, in a world seemingly devoid of life, we encounter the ice worm, a creature that defies the very limits of survival. These small, thread-like worms, barely an inch long, thrive in temperatures that would kill most other organisms. They burrow through the ice, creating intricate tunnels and feeding on algae and bacteria that grow on the surface. Their bodies produce a unique antifreeze protein that prevents ice crystals from forming in their cells, allowing them to remain active even in sub-freezing temperatures. As temperatures rise, even slightly, these creatures face a perilous threat, making them highly susceptible to climate change. The ice worm serves as a powerful symbol of both the resilience and fragility of life. From the frozen wastelands, we journey to the fertile soils of the Palouse region of the Pacific Northwest, home to a creature of legendary proportions, the giant Palouse earthworm. These elusive giants, reaching lengths of over three feet, are a testament to the hidden wonders beneath our feet. Their pale, iridescent bodies, segmented like their smaller cousins, glide through the soil, aerating the ground and enriching it with their castings. The giant Palouse earthworm was once a common sight, its presence a sign of healthy soil and a thriving ecosystem. However, habitat loss and degradation have pushed this gentle giant to the brink of extinction. Today, sightings of the giant Palouse earthworm are rare and cherished, a reminder of the importance of conservation efforts. Their story serves as a call to action, urging us to protect the delicate balance of our planet's ecosystems. Our journey takes us now to the sandy shores and muddy bottoms of coastal waters, where we encounter a creature as peculiar as its namesake, the peanut worm. These unsegmented worms, ranging in size from a few millimeters to several centimeters, owe their name to their ability to contract their bodies into a peanut-like shape when threatened. This remarkable defense mechanism helps them deter predators and escape harm. 
peanut worms are burrowers, using their muscular bodies to dig into the sand or mud. They are deposit feeders, consuming organic matter found in the sediment and playing a crucial role in nutrient cycling within their ecosystems. Their bodies are surprisingly complex, featuring an introvert, a retractable proboscis used for feeding, and a trunk containing their internal organs. Peanut worms are a diverse group, with over 300 species found worldwide. Our exploration takes us deeper into the ocean depths, to the rocky reefs and coral formations where we encounter a creature that seems to defy gravity, the ice cream cone worm. These sedentary worms are named for their distinctive cone-shaped tubes, which they construct from grains of sand, shell fragments, and other materials. These tubes, cemented together with a special secretion, provide a safe haven from predators and the harsh ocean currents. The ice cream cone worm's body is segmented with feathery tentacles extending from the opening of its tube. These tentacles, covered in tiny cilia, act as filters, trapping plankton and other organic particles from the water column. As the tentacles capture food, they move it towards the worm's mouth, located at the base of the cone. Their intricate tubes, often found clustered together, add to the structural complexity of the reef, providing shelter and attachment points for other marine organisms. Our journey now takes us to the deep sea, a realm of perpetual darkness and crushing pressure where we encounter a creature that embodies the mystery and resilience of life in the abyss, the parchment tube worm. These remarkable worms, named for their leathery parchment-like tubes, are found clustered around hydrothermal vents, fissures in the ocean floor where superheated water spews forth from the Earth's interior. The parchment tube worm's survival in this extreme environment depends on a remarkable symbiotic relationship with bacteria. These bacteria, housed within the worm's body, convert the chemicals spewing from the vents into usable energy, a process known as chemosynthesis. Lacking a mouth and digestive system, the parchment tube worm relies entirely on these symbiotic bacteria for its sustenance. The discovery of the parchment tube worm and its chemosynthetic lifestyle revolutionized our understanding of life on Earth. From the depths of the ocean, we journey back to the shallows, to the sandy intertidal zones where we encounter a creature that provides a glimpse into the distant past, the acorn worm. These unsegmented worms, named for their acorn-shaped proboscis, are considered living fossils, their lineage dating back over 500 million years. Their primitive body plan and unique characteristics offer valuable insights into the early evolution of chordates, the group of animals that includes vertebrates like ourselves. Acorn worms are burrowers, using their proboscis to dig through the sand in search of food. They are deposit feeders, consuming organic matter found in the sediment, and playing an important role in nutrient cycling within their ecosystems. The acorn worm, a humble inhabitant of the intertidal zone, reminds us that even the most unassuming creatures can hold the keys to understanding the grand narrative of life on Earth. Our exploration takes us back to the ocean depths, to the dark, cold waters of the deep sea, where we encounter a creature that illuminates the abyss with its bioluminescent brilliance, the bomber worm. These segmented worms, typically a few inches long, are named for their remarkable defense mechanism. When threatened, they release glowing green bioluminescent bombs from their body, creating a dazzling distraction that allows them to escape predators. These bombs are actually modified gills, packed with light-producing cells called photocytes. The bomber worm's bioluminescence serves not only as a defense mechanism but also as a means of communication. Their ability to produce light in the darkness of the deep sea highlights the extraordinary adaptations that life has evolved to survive in even the most challenging environments. Our final destination takes us to the misty slopes of Mount Kinabalu in Borneo home, to a creature that embodies the gigantism often found on islands, the Kinabalu giant earthworm. These impressive worms, reaching lengths of over two feet, are among the largest earthworms on Earth. Their dark slimy bodies, segmented like their smaller cousins, glide through the rich volcanic soil, aerating the ground and enriching it with their castings. The Kinabalu giant earthworm is a testament to the unique biodiversity found on islands, 
Isolated from mainland populations, island species often evolve in unique ways, leading to the development of unusual sizes, shapes, and behaviors. Their presence is a sign of a healthy forest ecosystem. From the vibrant colors of the tiger flatworm to the bioluminescent brilliance of the bomber worm, we've explored a world of unimaginable diversity and wonder. These 10 weird worms, each with its unique adaptations and survival strategies, serve as a testament to the endless creativity of evolution. Their stories remind us that even in the most unlikely of creatures, we can find beauty, complexity, and inspiration. If you've enjoyed this journey into the weird and wonderful world of worms, be sure to like this video, subscribe to our channel for more amazing animal encounters, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on our next adventure. Until then, keep exploring the wonders of the natural world.